How is it going out there, everybody? This is Speedboy14 on my playthrough of Super KO Boxing 2 for the iOS device. If you guys can give me a favor and drop a like on this video, I'd really appreciate it big time if you're new to my channel. Don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell right beside it. Be notified every time I make new videos. Exciting feature of the channel. You can request your favorite opponent or your favorite circuit in the game in the comments below. Also, let me know down in the comments below for a question of the video. Which kind of mobile device do you prefer? Android or iOS and why? Me, I prefer the iOS devices over Android because... I've just always had iOS devices. We're going to do the challenge mode major circuit now. Chal so here we go. We cannot use super punches. We cannot get back up. We cannot lightning KO. We must use DZ combo. Excuse me. So the gimmick of this is we just need to dodge and punch until we DZ him. And we have to use the DZ combo on him. Which is right hook punch, left hook punch, right hook punch. That's it. It's literally that simple. And we just need to repeat this three times for a TKO. Just like that. It's literally simple. I messed up. Messed up. Although we got DZ there, but I messed up. We can make up for it by DZ and him again, as long as we don't mess up again. Otherwise, follow the same strategy as circuit mode. Okay, right hook punch, left hook punch, right hook punch. That's the DZ combo, right, th right there. Just dodge and punch. That's all you do with this guy. Dodge, hook punch at the right time. All right. There we go. We did it. That was challenge mode 15 cent. Now we're going to go ahead and do challenge mode chief. Setting Sun is what his challenge mode name is. It's kind of like 15 cents, so it's no change. All right, chief. The only objective here is they cannot get hit. Otherwise, it's still easy. Just like that. You can get supers and knock them out quick. The strategy is literally simple. Now he gets up. What you have to do now is you have to taunt him to have him punch you, and then you dodge his attacks. Just like you did for regular Chief. Just like that. It's literally simple.
What? He stayed down for the count? That was lucky. I wasn't anticipating that at all. I thought he was going to get up for a second. That was really lucky. Now we're going to do challenge mode Voo Dude, otherwise known as Voo Don't. Here we go. There's an infinite combo you can do on Voo Dude. It's not a guarantee infinite, but it does give you lots and lots of hits. You must TKO him and you cannot do DZ combos. That's the challenge of this fight. And it's a, this is a good fight to do this infinite. After doing a combo with body blows, you just, after it's done, just do a face punch. And then do, and then you can just do that. It doesn't matter what the, it doesn't matter what the last punch of the combo is. If it's a, if it's a, if it's a face punch, you have to start it with a body blow. If it's a, if it's a body blow, you have to start it with a face punch. It's pretty cool. I just thought I'd show you his infinite combo. It's not a full infinite, but it does make you go on for a decent amount of time. We can do a level three super punch right now to get his health really low. When he does the curse punch, I always dodge it. There we go. We're doing really good. He got up. Of course, we have to do just like we did in regular video. Just punch him to have him punch you. Oh, we got an achievement to land 2,000 punches? That is an awesome achievement. All right, on to bigger gift now. Bigger gift, here we go. Honky Tonk is what it says. Here we go, challenge mode, bigger gip. So the challenge is, we have to win in round one, we must KO him, and then his punches do double damage on us. So we can hit his weak spot immediately by taunting and then punching him in the stomach. For a very easy two second knockdown. Just like with regular bigger gip. Oh, he's staying down for a long time. He got up on 10 though. So he gets a really, really good refill. But in phase two, you wanna always knock him down with a super to ha maximize the chance of him staying down. That's why it's best to knock him down with a super in phase two. That's why I did a hook punch to earn a super meter while he was standing still so I can get a super just to ensure that my super would knock him down and to ensure he would stay down for the KO and he did. Excuse me. <laughs> And now we're going to do correct you bones. Which is challenge mode correct you bones. All right, here we go. So 
So we must KO and we cannot block. All right. So we dodge right, left, right to dodge his rock attack in round one. We have to do max damage on his face and on his stomach, like this. I'm not gonna do any supers until I do a good amount of damage on him. So remember how to dodge the rock attack, it's the same way as regular Karaki Bones. Once I get level two damage on his face, I'll start using some supers. All right, we're doing good so far. I'll go and use two supers right there. And there we go. We got doubled, we got level two damage on his face and on his stomach. Anytime he gets up, he always gets a full health refill. It won't matter in round two because we'll do level three damage on him. Which I'm just going to beat up on him until round two starts. And we'll beat him in round two. There we go. This will be the only challenge mode match I'll have to go to round two for. Because the others I won't have even have to go to round two. So just dodge his attacks, combo him, until we get the level three damage on his face and stomach. Dodge left to avoid the first one of the rock attack and it's random which way you have to dodge to avoid the others. I got hit there, that's okay. We just need to dodge. All right. We just need to do this. Dodge these. He gave me an easy pattern. Wow. Excuse me. He's doing it again. We're doing really good, though. I'm actually going to start beating up on his stomach now because we need to get the level 3 damage on his stomach for him to stay down. So in order to do this, we'll have to beat up on his stomach until he, um, cause we already did maximum damage on his face. And we did on his stomach just now. And make sure we knock him down with a super to maximize the chance of him staying down. And we did. And he won't get up from that. <laughs> we only have one more opponent of the challenge mode major circuit, which is Shogun. And he's definitely an easy one to do. Karaki Bones has... Cracky Bones is simple strategy wise. It's just a long fight because of what you need to do. All right, so we need to go on to Shogun, faux show. Here we go. This one's really interesting. All right. Mm 
we cannot get hit is the only objective here. <laughs> We can get a super right here and we can dodge his start mode punches. And then after we dodge all these, we can super punch and break him out of dark mode and then we can uh, to dizzy him and then we can do a body blow for a lightning KO. It's that easy. Next time we'll do the final circuit of challenge mode, which is the challenge mode world circuit. And all right, guys, that's it. Thank you very much for watching, guys. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button and click on the bell. Be no better time to make new videos. Have a wonderful day. Peace, Republic of Speedboy.